Hey Hang Titers, this is Marcy. So now this is fitness talk number nine and I wanted to do a fitness talk on stress relief. So a lot of us have stresses um, during our lives and it could be um, for numerous reasons. A lot of us are in different situations. Again, um, some of us are working, some of us are in school, some of us are just you know, hanging around. Um, and you can get stressed in many different ways. I mean, you can get stressed because you don't have a job. You can get stressed um, if you're overweight and you're really just trying to lose weight and you're frustrated because you're not losing weight. Um, there could be a death in the family, so that would bring up the holidays. The holidays might be tough. And a lot of things people tend to do when they get stressed is they eat or they do drugs or they do something to comfort them in some type of way. And so this fitness talk is to kind of infuse you with fitness in a sense that when you're stressed, you don't always have to go to those bad outlets and feel in that dark side in your life. You can revert to fitness. So something you might want to just consider is, you know, especially if you're just starting off, is just to go for a walk or run. If you're just fed up, if someone makes you mad, if you just need to get away from things for a minute, don't go and gorge on food and do anything unhealthy. Just go for a simple walk, go for a simple run. And you can even do it in your casual clothes if you need to, because if, if the fact of getting into workout clothes, just go walk is like your turnoff point, which stresses you out even more, just work in your casual clothes, it'll be fine. And so those are just some, some suggestions that I recommend for, you know, the minor stress relief. So working out, when you get your blood pumping and moving, you're able to relax, you're able to um, sweat a little bit, and you forget about everything that you're doing. So some things that I often do when I get stressed, I go for a run. Running helps me in numerous ways. I put on my um, iPod and I just run. So you run, you sweat, when you're done, you take a nice shower, and you feel a lot better. So that's another stress relief. Um, drinking uh, some warm tea might be a good comforting thing that you might want to do. And it ultimately, is, it, it depends up to you. You know what makes you happy. If sleeping makes you happy, that's fine. But you know, you don't want to get in the habit of every time you get depressed or somebody makes you mad, you go to sleep. That's not really recommended either. So find that thing that makes you happy, whether it be, um, you know, exercising and even yoga. I often do yoga. Yoga is a perfect um, exercise that allows you to spend time with yourself. That's why I like it so much because you're breathing, you're spending time with your body, you block everything else out, and it's a little form of meditation as well. So I hope that helps. Um, if you don't want to do yoga, there's Pilates. There's a lot of other things you can do. Just gentle stretching will help. Being in a place, talking to someone that you are good friends with um, might help you get through something stressful. So this is just, again, to help you get through those stressful times in your life. We all go through it. Even people that don't believe that they're stressed, uh, they're really stressed. They don't know it. Because <laughs> I've met so many people that are like, oh, there's no such thing as stress. I believe everyone has stresses in their lives and everybody handles it differently. So. Try and um, infuse fitness into your stress. Try and go for a walk or run, work out, work out with a friend, and it will actually really, really help you uh, get your blood moving and everything else. So I hope that helps uh, you get on track and stay focused with your fitness goals. Don't get discouraged if you're not losing weight. Don't get discouraged if you have cellulite. It's going to lessen and shrink away the more you push at it. So don't stop, keep pushing, and I'll see you for our next fitness talk. Bye.